and welcome back to another video from small axe music productions um today i'm just gonna be showing you guys how to route the drums for bfd3 and to let you have a listen of the first track that i've created with bfd3 all right so you're gonna be hearing how it sounds in the in reggae feel and also show you how I wrote the, the, the channels for, for mix for recording and mixing. Alright, so here I have a session. Um, I'll just play a bit of it so you could hear it and we'll go right into it. By the way, I've al already recorded the drums, so but I'm just gonna show you what I did to get it recorded. Alright, so let's go. so there you have the bad boy all right so let me just go right ahead and show you how i get this thing um, i already disabled it and hide it so let me just get it back in the session so that's my drum track midi i'm going to be showing you how i wrote the channels for BFD all right here we go by the way um, it's a second one all right by the way let me just go ahead and um, disable these that I already did and show you guys from scratch all right so here we go first i created what four stereo tracks and nine 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 mono tracks so let's go and start with the nine mono tracks all right nine let's add the four stereo tracks four stereo tracks there we are and i just colored them right away so we could have have a look all right so first i'm gonna be going in um bfd all right and first let me just go ahead and go back into mixing session window here 
and start. So first you go right in plugins when you're working with Pro Tools, similar with other DAWs. I select one, select two, that's mono. These are all the mono tracks I'm selecting. I'm assigning here. Four, five, six, seven, eight. This is the last mono track. And then we go to the auxiliary tracks. Let's select it start from two because the um stereo one is basically a stereo track for the whole drum kit right so you want to assign different things to these tracks so start with two three stereo three um right four and last one is five all right so all right let's arm the tracks for recording my bad i arm the wrong track here all right let's go ahead and arm them no big deal all right so my computer is moving a bit slow so it's causing a, quite a havoc here all right so um, I think that's all. All right, so let's go open up BFD now. All right, I like to do my drums differently. I like to have totally complete control, right? All right, and then I have it on separate tracks. Makes sense. So what you could do is click this little arrow here on the kick drum. All right. If you realize the kick has this arrow, the snare, and the ambient mix have these. All three of them have these um, little arrow pointing. So you click it, open up when I have kick in, kick out, sub kick. And this is the master feel for both, for all three of these, all right? So let's go right in now. For at the bottom here, you see mono one. That's where you go to assign it. So you look for, don't go to stereo or augs or side chain. You go to mono, right? And you go to one. That's the kick in. What I do, I put the mono two here and the sub. Right? It's already assigned, by the way, to two. Right? It's already assigned. But let me just go ahead and do it for the sake of some people. Alright? So the sub and the and the kick out is going on one track right i like that's how i like to do it you could do it on separate tracks as well but that is how i do it all right yeah that is how we do it at small axe music productions all right now let's go move on to the snare um for the snare we go right ahead and do this see probably the same thing channel three that's for snare top and channel um four for snare bottom I also put the, the, the rim on channel 3 all right so the top on the 3 and the, 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 the rim snare rim goes together and if you realize what I did is turn up the rim because these guys don't make good rim shots for reggae right so you have to help yourself around right even though BFD is better way better than addictive drums right it's still have some downside to it right i love it very much but it still has some downside these guys need to to hire a reggae drummer with the reggae kit as i said before to addictive drums they didn't listen right but i think bfd X, f expansion needs to hire a reggae drummer um as i stated in previous videos to have a reggae kit with the reggae sneer and the reggae timpani that's this and those reggae sneers that we can get that nice crisp of a, of a reggae accented sound right so guys at X, f expansion please please remember us reggae musicians all right all right
let me not stray away from it right but anyway let's get back so those two are on one track all right so let's go ahead now and close it up back and move on so we are where we stopped at four this one is at five all right and all the others already you can see they are um assigned all right but let's go so you go on and you put this on six on six and so forth all right not to not um waste any time they are already assigned right um i already did it um beforehand so they are assigned so let's move on the symbols now i like to put my symbols on the last stereo um track so i go and put it on six all the symbols stereo stereo all right six oh my bad i think it was stereo five oh, sorry my bad it was stereo five stereo five all right let's go ahead and reassign this one stereo five okay so all three symbols have stereo five let's go to the ambient channel and click it now we open it we see overhead room and ambient here all right so let's put those on and put this one on two all right put this one on three which is the room and put this one on four all right so there we have it all right let's go ahead and close this off and see if we have all our kit pieces coming through all right let's play it there we have it right um we are all coming through let me just go ahead and and even further test this thing so here we have the kicks and if you realize certain things the kick is bleeding through the seniors these are the seniors these two here are the seniors so it's bleeding a bit all right the sneer is bleeding um, these are the over ambient um, the overhead and the room all right all right so we have it time one time two time three time four all right snare that's the snare and the snare is also bleeding in the kick you can see the wood kicks having that bleed and you could adjust it and take out the bleed but for my sake, I use that one, right? All right, for those of you who wonder how I make my reggae beats, um, I started from scratch, right? And this is how I, I hand played it, right? All right. All right, this is what I'm talking about, guys, that F expansion. I know you guys watch <laughs> for sure. All right. This is what I'm talking about. I need a crank, crank, that crank on the snare. This one's supposed to be ringing out, right? More of sound like a timpani, right? Type of sound, right? So, guys, please have those snare samples. I went on your website and I checked to see if you guys have those snares and I preview all the snares and i'm still not getting that reggae sound that we are longing for in this 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 vst right so guys i have to be working my way around to get certain things 
right and implementing different things in into bfd to along with bfd to get certain sounds but guys it would be so nice to have the whole reggae kit please guys it's a plus right you guys are, i'm sure you guys are gonna make extra bucks on, on that thing all right so anyway i love the drums it's very nice i compliment you guys on, on making this and making this um very nice um drum um vst it's very nice right i i this my preferred um choice for drums when i'm not using live drums i use live drums as well all right so what so i know what i'm supposed to be hearing all right all right my drum set is right sitting in front of me right now <laughs> okay so guys think about us and and do something for us hire a reggae drummer from jamaica with this kit and maybe two reggae drummers that would be nice <laughs> all right so we could have at least more than one reggae kit um right and some reggae variations as well all right so this is how you wrote the bfd guys um uh very simple it's nothing technical right so i think that's it for now all right so have yourself a wonderful day or night whatever but take care and thanks for making it small Axe music productions thanks for all the support that you guys been giving me right remember to hit me up on the website that you could throw your comments and um whatever you guys need if in terms like if i can show you guys i won't hold back all right so enough respect enough love from small Axe music productions again Irie, I'm out of here. See you.